Hello there and welcome back to another juice review from myself, Welsh Vapster, founder of Facebook group Vapster's Paradise. Today I'm doing a juice review on Frost Frosty Fruits from the good guys over at Juice Source, Mr. George Dimmock and Mr. Kevin Lester. Now today we've got eight juices to get through. Here are just three of them just to give you an idea of what we got going on here. We got strawberry. We have peach, we have mango, we have grape, we have pineapple, uh, blueberry, orange, and lemon. All fresh solo fruit juices. You don't tend to see many solo fruit juices about. You normally tend to get them like, um, I don't know, like a strawberry and kiwi, like a, a grape and bubblegum, or something is always mixed in with that fruit. These guys at Juice Source Frosty Fruits have done them as a solo fruit. You got that little touch of coolada in it to give it like the frosty type of effect, the coldness in there. It's very well blended in. It's not too cold. It's not one that gives you like the attack, the, the effect of like a brain freeze or where you're blowing the vape out your nose and makes your nose cold. No, you don't get none of that. It's just the right amount, a good balance there of the coolada mixed in with the fruit. Um, so we're going to jump straight down now into the first juice review. I'll give you a little bit of a talk more about it um, as the range, as, as the my opinion right across the, the board with all of the juices as a whole, as a juice line. I'm going to be uh, dropping the links down in the description if you guys so wish you want to go and purchase some. Um, and there we go. So first one we're going to jump into i think we're going to do let's do the strawberry first now before we before i get into this now i've already juiced up by you what i do is i do the first juice review i clip it then i jump straight into the second one already loaded up ready to go for the second juice so let's have a look at these close-ups of the bottles here look at these labels kind of like a transparency through those labels i love how they've done the design of these as you go around there, look, you've got 50 ml short fills, 0 milligram TBD compliant. Um, on the back there, then, you've got your 18, no under 18, you've got your warnings, you've got your cautions at the top, you've got your barcodes there. Now, I like these Gorilla bottles as well. Also, I don't know if you've had many Gorilla bottles, but those of you who have will know where I'm going with this. Um, with the Gorilla bottles that have come out um uh, post TBD, um, you got these caps that are on top, and I don't know about you, but I've gone through many of my kitchen knives out by there, trying to jam it in and wedge it to pop those little gits out. <laughs> I think I've even chipped a couple of teeth trying to bite the waggers out, but no, these, if you look closely in by your, let's get a, a little little bit of focus in there. Let's have a look, yeah. Um, there we go, there we go, it's plain, plain for any room now. As you can see, you've got that lip going around by there. So what you do, you just pop, uh, pop. you can pop your finger in by there, and then boom, out it comes. There we go, as easy as that, and I drop the lid, but that's how easy it is. You can poke it out with the tip of your nail to drop your nicotine shots in. Now they do come in zero milligram, as you can see, um, with then your desired nicotine shot. So you can either have it, you know, you don't put any nicotine in if you're on a zero. You put half of 10 million if you're on a 0.5. You put a full, full 10 million to make it a three, which you then get 60 mil worth of juice at three milligram nicotine. So, fragrance on this. You can smell straight away. That's as fresh, fresh as you like strawberry. Kind of like a Ribena juice drink. Where you get that fresh strawberry flavor but it's not as sweet as a ribena juice drink it's just freshly squeezed juice of that fruit that it is meant to represent very well done 
All of these as well are 80-20 VGPG, so they're the max VG juice. Again, that have stunned me because the strength of these flavors is sublime. This really, really well done for a max VG. You don't expect to get that. So thumbs up for that one. So let's have a vape for you. As you can see, vapor production, plenty. Don't need no more than that. Flavors, right. This one is nice. It's, it's a nice, sweet, mouth-watering flavor. That flavor is consistent, stays in your mouth right away from the start to the end of that vape. Even thereafter, all that vape is exhaled from, from your mouth. The flavor is still flooding around in my mouth. It's nice. It's sweet, it's juicy, it's mouth-watering. Very well done. I really do like that juice. So what we're going to do now, we're going to jump on to the next one, which is going to be... And here it is. It is going to be Frosty Fruit Lemon. You can't really see there because of the light, but it's a lemon. Frosty Fruit's Lemon, but there smell on this one perfect 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 lemon vape um now with lemon vapes where what i to get with this when somebody mentions a lemon vape to me i instantly go down the line of i don't know say a lemon tart a dinner ladies lemon tart or um others they've done lemon meringues or like a like a, a i don't know lemon tarty type of things like a syrupy type of lemon this is not like that. Now I was a bit I was a, I was a bit iffy about uh, vaping this one when I first started because vaping the rest of them and how fresh of a fruit flavour they all have been, I was kind of thinking, well, is this one going to be a little bit too bitter, sour, or you know, a little bit too tangy? But mm -mm, smell of it, yeah, you think it's going to be just a perfect lemon flavour? Absolutely, it's going to be sour, but it's not. Let me have a vape first. Mm -mm -mm. Now it is. It is definitely lemon. Bang on. You cannot say that tastes of anything other than a lemon. Now, when I was doing the live review of these juices uh, not so long back, one of the members in the comments described that perfectly to the way I was trying to explain what was going on with me as I was vaping it. Now, it is exactly like that. It is as if you're biting into a nice, to a, 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 a fresh lemon without the bitterness. It's that lemon flavor, but you've got a little bit of a tang there, but there's a sweetness added also, which takes that bitterness and sourness away. It just leaves that lemon flavor, you know, just melodying on your tongue. It's just doing a dance on your tongue. It's beautiful. Really, really nice. That, I will put that up there as probably the best lemon vape I have ever had. You know, because others I've had, they've been lemon tarty or they've been lemon, like a, like a, like a jammy lemon, you know, that type of sweet lemon type of thing or with a with a biscuit -y or a cakey type of base or meringue base now this one is just pure lemon with a little bit of sweetness in there which takes that bitterness away so it's very very nice and as i said one of the best lemon if not the best lemon vape i have ever had so well done on that one that's a strawberry and lemon done now we're going to move on to the next one which is going to be And it is going to be Frosty Fruits Peach. Now, smell on this one is beautiful. Um, you, you smell this and it, it, it makes you think of you're going to get a mouth-watering, juicy, ripe, sweet peach. That is the smell on it. It is stunning. Now, the vape on it is quite a bit different to what it smells like to what it gives you the idea that it's going to be. So let me take a vape.
Now, flavour is is there. It, it hits your mouth straight away. Now, what I described to you as in the fragrance I was getting, the flavour is rather different. The flavour is is quite bitter. Um, what I was ex I, what I was expecting it to be a nice mouthwatering, uh, ripe, sweet peach. Um, you expect to have a little bit of a bitterness in there because it is a fresh fruit. That is exactly what they are. They are, they are very, very fresh. You expect a little bit of a tanginess, but it's too bitter for me. There's no, there's not enough sweetness in there. If there was a little bit of sweetness added, as with the lemon that I just vaped for you, um, if there was that kind of thing going on in it, this would be one of the best peach vapes I have ever had, if not, again, one of the best. But unfortunately, it was a little bit disappointing for me because there was too much of a bitterness going on there. There wasn't enough sweetness. It still makes your mouth water. Flavour is consistent. Vapour production is brilliant. But because it's a little bit too bitter, it's, it, it takes it away a little bit. But... That's not taking anything away from that juice. Other people might love it being that, I know, that little bit too bitter with less sweetener, but I would prefer it with a bit more sweetness to it. So, without further ado, let's move on to the next one, which is going to be... This one is going to be Frosty Fruits Pineapple. Again, look at those labels, that transparency on there. Love it. Very well done. Good job, guys, over at Juice Source. Well done. I love these labels. Really good. Fragrance. <laughs> now, this one, this one is one of my favourite frosty fruit juices. This one, oh, wow. That, that, that smell that you're getting, it is... Same as the others, it's a pineapple. It's a fresh, juicy, ripe pineapple. You can't, it, you can't take it away from you. You can't say that it smells of anything else added to it, or you can't describe it as anything else other than what it actually is. It's a pineapple. So let me take a vape fill. Oh wow. Wow, straight away, straight away, my mouth is just flooding, flooding with water. Wow, flavour, bang, nice, ripe, juicy, sweet pineapple. You buy, you buy pi fresh pineapple fruit, you cut it all up and boom, you slice yourself a bit of pineapple, you take a bite of it. That is that going on in your mouth without actually chewing or eating a pineapple. It's, it's, it's mad how they've done it again with the Max Vigi juice. You don't expect the flavours to be that dominant, that powerful, that strong. But they really, really are. Damn well. Good job. Good job. As I said, one of my favourite Frosty Fruits flavours. Not the favourite overall, but it is up there. Very, very well done. Highly recommend this juice to people. Brilliant. So let's move on to the next one, and it is going to be so. The next one, guys, is going to be frosty fruit mango. Fragrance on that again, mango, bang on mango. Now, very strong flavor. Anyway, mango is. Like vapes I've had previously with mango included in it. Mango, even mixed with other types of flavours, mango always is the dominant flavour of that vape. Even if you've got like, I don't know, like a, a mango on a pineapple or a, a mango cake type of, type of, you know, flavour profile going on. Mango is always the one that comes out on top. Of the flavors you can pick out first as you're describing each flavor profile that's in that juice. So this is a mango, a solo mango. Let's take a vape of it for you. Mm. 
It is good. It is good. It's sweet. It's one of those type of vapes that when you inhale it, you can taste it coming out of your out of your nose before you start exhaling the vape. Flavors just instantly going on inside your palate for the um one of those flavors that sits on your tongue it's, it's right away through the vape again consistent same as the other ones consistent flavor doesn't strengthen flavor doesn't weaken anywhere at all through that vape on the inhale right away through to the last breath of the exhale same flavor right away through doesn't differ at all so that flavor now in every single one of them you got that frostiness you got that cool ardor in it but it isn't a, an overly powerful cool ardor it doesn't it doesn't give you like a brain freeze type of effect it doesn't doesn't make your your, your nose cold as you're exhaling the vape it doesn't tickle your throat it's just nice it's just like a frosty tickle on the back of your throat it's, it's brilliant how they've done it how they blended those 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 that juice and that coolada it's a good blend with each other like a 50 50 none none no one is more dominant than the other it's just blended in very very well a good percentage of coolada in these juices spot on guys now as it as I said, that's that's a that's another dominant flavor of they've done it, but it's not overly powerful. Whereas mangoes, mango vapes can tend to, for me anyway, tend to get a little bit sickly. You get bored of it very quickly. I can't see me getting bored of that one too fast. It's not a sickly type of mango. It, it is sweet. It's it's a dominant flavor, but it's not one you can get sick of. So. Well done on that one, guys. So now let's move on to the next one, and it is going to be it is going to be frosty fruit blueberry. It, it, again, it's just, it's only you, you pop open a, a planet of, of blueberries that you you buy from your 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 local supermarket. You come home with a fresh load of fruit. You get a planet of blueberries you open them up and you get the smell instantly of that fruit that is that it smells exactly like a blueberry so let's take a vape for you wow wow you get that's that, that ripeness that sweetness the juiciness it's it's all going on there it's, it's mad. It's, it's it's really surprised me how bang on to the exact fruit these these juices are. You you you, you cannot. Say, I cannot say anyway that I've had. I can't. I can't say that this is the best blueberry vape that I've had. But it is. There is definitely no other blueberry vape out there that tastes so much like that like a blueberry fruit they are 100 percent real the flavor on that you get from there it's real it is that fruit without a doubt no ifs no buts no maybes no this that whatever blah 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 it is exact it is that fruit down to a t how they've done it blows my mind i do not know but well done it's like as if you you're opening up that planet of blueberries you you take you're gripping yourself an handful chuck them in your mouth that first bite when all the juices boom, explode in your mouth definitely that 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 is that is the, the 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 what is making me think that i'm doing i'm chewing on a mouthful of blueberries brilliantly done very well done another very very good vape can't fault it at all so let's move on to the next one and it is going to be and it is going to be frosty fruit grape smell on this now i don't even have to put it in my nose to smell it that's how that's how pungent the the the, the fragrance on it is you can smell it straight away now what i was exp what i was hoping to get from this vape um was that it was going to be 
different to any other great vape that I have had. Um, because I don't know if any of you will agree with me here, but with grape flavors, the grape itself always seems to taste the same. I don't know why it, you know, even if you have it from different different places, from different concentrates, from different companies, it always tastes the same. It's never any different. Yeah, you get some that like a grape bubble gum or like a grape candy or I don't know, a grape soda, um, which which makes it a little bit different. But the grape flavor itself is always the same. But I was hoping that this one was going to be that one grape grape juice that I had that I could, I could say was different. But unfortunately, it's not. But it's still a nice vape. It is still a, a, a really nice vape. If you like grape flavors, you're going to enjoy this one. But I was hoping I could say that it was different. This was going to be the one that I could say, wow, that is different to any other grape flavor that I've had. But it's not. I would like this to be maybe a little less sweet than what it is. It is a very sweet juice. It's the sweetest. It's sweeter than the mango. It's sweeter than the blueberry. It's the sweet, sweetest juice out of the eight that I've got here for review. Um, but this one, whereas with the lemon and the peach, I want, uh, you know, no, not with the lemon. With with the peach, I wanted more sweetness and a little bit less bitterness. Maybe with the grape, I want a little bit of less sweetness and a little bit more bitterness to make it like like you're actually eating a grape. But it's a little bit too sweet, so that's where this juice have let me down a little bit. So, and it's not that different from any others. It still tastes very very similar to others so but not taking anything away from that one either if you like your grape flavors i'm assuming you're gonna very much like this grape flavor because it is nice so let's move on to the last one last but not least and it is going to be and it is going to be my favorite out of the entire range I'd say my favorite orange vape I've had anywhere, anytime before this. It is Frosty Fruits Orange. Now, I have been searching for that orange vape that have made me go just wow. And this is the one that have made me go wow. You can see there, look, I'm just over halfway through that vape. I cannot get enough of it. It is stunning the one pr before i found this one that i thought was really nice the you know my favorite up until this one was fresh squeezed orange elements e-liquid now that was a very nice orange vape but that one was a little it was sweet it was sweeter than anything and it ruined your cotton and your coils this one is sweet but it's bitter. Um, it's a proper citrus type of flavor. Um, it's 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 not it's not a it's it's not a full-on orange. It's not a blood orange. It's in between. It's like a like a satsuma tangerine type of one. It's it's sweet. It's bitter. It's juicy. It's ripe. It's 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 all them going on in there. You know. It's not just too sweet, it's not just too bitter, it's there in the middle. That's where it sits. And with that frostiness that you get in there as well, it's like having a fresh cup of freshly squeezed orange juice in the sitting out in the sun in, in the sun in the summer, up there with a, a, a nice iced up glass of orange juice. That is that brilliant, brilliant juice. So let me have a vape of it. Of course I'm gonna have a vape of it. I got to. I love this stuff. Beautiful. Oh wow! I can't, I can't, I can't quite 
explain to you the effect it's having in my mouth but there but it is beautiful take my word for it it is gorgeous if you like orange vapes please please pick yourself up some frosty fruits orange oh it's wonderful it is wonderful it really is good so there we go that's my top vape so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna put these in order of my favorite to my uh least favorite I'm not saying the my the, the one that sits in last position is horrible because it's not it's just it could do with a little bit of tweaking for me to make it as nice as the others so in top position is going to go the orange without the doubt the orange beautiful stuff in second position i'm going to put the strawberry that's going in second again exactly like the fruit it's meant to be in third position with a shock to me is going to go the lemon because that was beautiful really really nice it is exactly that fruit with like as if you're biting into a fresh lemon without the full-on bitterness you've got a sweetness in there as well very very nice very nice in third place i'm going to put the pineapple again very very right very very sweet very very mouth watering bang on pineapple again brilliantly done pineapple is going in fourth place in fifth place i'm going to put the blueberry that's going in fifth place another very very good vape same as the others all of them really are consistent in flavor a frostiness in all of them is perfectly balanced very well done in sixth position i'm going to put the mango because i didn't get sick of this mango it's not too sweet it's a dominant flavor it's a very strong flavor you can taste it coming out your nose before you even start it to exhale but it's not too sweet it's not sickly sweet it's just nice it's really nice and then in seventh position last but not least i'm going to put the peach that's going in seventh position it let me down a little bit because there wasn't enough sweetness in there it was a little bit too bitter it doesn't taste like it smells i wish it did taste like it smells maybe a tweak it a little bit and add a little bit more sweetness but still not taking anything away from it it is a still a damn good peach vape and then in the last position still not taking anything away from it because it is a, a nice vape is the grape it's a little bit too sweet this one differs from the peach where i want a little bit more sweetness in the peach i like a little bit less sweetness in the grape and a little bit more bitterness to make it that fresh grape type of vape but as an entire range right across the board i'm gonna give a huge double thumbs up on this on this range very very good kudos to george dimmock on creating these and making these juices and kevin lester over the both of these guys over at juice source for getting this juice line frosty fruits up and running getting these out for me out to me for the purpose of review for you guys i take my hat off again to you for doing such an amazing flavors on solo fruits as they are with that frostiness in there very well done i would recommend these vapes to people who were into their fruity vapes anyway so there we go again i cannot thank you enough for watching my reviews and until the next time